a bit of a range for Duke Ellington back in the 60s uh, when he was playing in Las Vegas. So uh, I decided I would do a number that they had done years before, a number written by Juan Tizol and Duke, and uh, the name of it was Perdido. So I modernized it up. Instead of a slow kind of a tempo, I had a swinging, uh, hard driving uh, thing on that I, I did with that. And I did it for Duke Ellington's band. Thank 
Counts for the Count is a number that I wrote for Count Basie. He asked me to write a special number for him. And he, what he wanted to do was kind of uh, uh, do a thing where he would uh, uh, lengthen out the length of uh, arrangements. You know, the early arrangements in the ballrooms and everything usually would be about three minutes. And of course, this ended up being about 10 minutes long. And that's what he wanted because he wanted to feature all of his great soloists. And that's what I did for him. Thank you. 
a great band. Yes, uh, they played my arrangement so good, so good. Blues for Union is a number I wrote for my three daughters, Cat. Uh, I wrote it after I had heard Fats Waller's great waltz, the Jitterbug waltz. But I wanted mine to be a real swinger. I also wanted to sound like the blues. And also I added some chord structure in there that I had learned from the great uh, classical composer, Aaron Carpeturian.
Castag is a number that I wrote, uh, that dedicated it to them. Of course, Castag is the school I attended in Detroit, Michigan. Uh, this is a number I wanted to honor some of the young writers that I like so well. This one is an a honor going to, to Benny Goldson, the great saxophonist and the great composer. Satin Doll is a number, of course, composed by the great Duke Ellington, and uh, Nancy Wilson wanted to do it. I was happy to do it for it because I liked it myself, and I was able to kind of get a, a good thing out of it for her. And she always liked it and always did it most of the time. Cigarette holder. 
swings me over his shoulder. He digs me out, got my satin doll. Baby, shall we go? I'll skip it. Careful of me, go.
when I know that you don't want me If you did, you'd be here by my side You deep, deep down inside Oh, why else would I be Suffering with a Thank you very much. And Scott Belk and the Jazz Ensemble, thank you so much. Mary Ellen Tanner. Miss Gretchen is a lady that owns uh, the record company, uh, Mac Avenue Records. And when I got on that label, and after I met her, I found her to be such a kind person and such a nice person that I wanted to do something to show how, how much I appreciated it. So I wrote this number and I called it Miss Gretchen.
Gretchen, Miss Gretchen, I can see, you can see Miss Gretchen's a tough woman, I'm telling you. She does so much for jazz there in Detroit. She helps them at the jazz festival every year. She helps do things there that needed to be done. You know, they had an old fountain at the park there where they have the festival, but it was all rusted up and there was no water in the fountain. It was a big fountain at one time. Miss Gretchen got tired of seeing that and she had the fountain restored and when you go there now to the festival, the beautiful water is coming out and she just tries to make everything better than it was. Miss Gretchen, I sure love her, she's great. Viva Tirado is a number that I wrote to play with my band for dancers and uh, the cha-cha-cha was very uh, popular at that time. I made a recording on it had some great uh, jazz soloists on it, Carmel Jones, Harold Land. And then uh, a group called El Chicano, they were recording one day and uh, they had finished their date and they had about 45 minutes left. And the uh, A&R man said, well, don't you have something else you can put on here now? He said, because we got some time left. So they said, yeah, I got a little number we've been playing. And they, start, they played my Viva Tirado. And of course, they're the ones who put it to the top of the charts in Billboard. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Thank you. 
chance for me to tell Scott Bell, thank you so very much for inviting me to come to Cincinnati to this great university. I want to thank all of the people here, Kim Pencil, my TA for many years at Northridge, and I want to thank all of the people that I've met here since I've been here for all of your kindness and how nice you are to everyone. We're getting ready to take this on out and then we'll call it a day.